Uh, this is the story of Andrew Tate, Greta Thunberg, and the Romanian police. Um, those of you who don't know Andy, Andrew Tate, Tate, I, I apologize for introducing you to him. Uh, your life is much better off not knowing who he is. Andrew Tate is a, uh, you know, bombastic showman, uh, misogynist, uh, uh, you know, made a, made a huge amount of money. Uh, he was originally a world champion kickboxer, very, very successful in kickboxing, and then made a huge amount of money, uh, money uh, basically with uh, webcams, porn, uh, style webcams and ultimately evolved into OnlyFans and they took that money and uh, he has, you know, it, it's one of these, how do you make money? You teach people how to make money. That's how you make money. And, and Andrew Tate, a lot of his wealth comes from coming up with bogus courses on how to, uh, teaching people how to make money. But if you get enough students, if you get, if you convince through all kinds of mechanisms, primarily marketing, that you can convince people that you can teach them how to make money, they'll give you a lot of money and by you'll get very, very wealthy. I think this is uh, what Andrew Tate has done. I haven't really dug in. He's a horrible human being who's, who has attracted a massive, uh, a massive number of fans among young right-wing men, uh, primarily because of his hatred of the left. Oh, you're on. What are you doing? Anybody who hates the left is one of the good guys. He's on our side. Not in my book. So uh, uh, he, is a, he is a hate of the left. He's also as I said, a misogynist, and, and just a, a, from everything I could tell, a, just generally a horrible human being. Um, and he lives a superficial, uh, materialistic life filled with cars and money and, and lots and lots of women and lots and lots of sex. He moved to Romania a few years ago, and he admitted to move to Romania because Romania has much looser laws with regard to rape. Uh, so it's an opportunity for him, uh, I guess, uh, to abuse young women. Andrew Tate is, has become very famous on social media. He's got a massive following on Twitter. Uh, again, young men, confused men, uh, men who don't know what to do with women, how to deal with women, men who do not have the self-esteem to deal with uh, wealth creation that's true wealth creation, to deal with relationships that are true relationships, uh, get, get sucked into... Uh, disgusting human beings like Andrew Tate. But, but there he is, very successful, big money, with a lot of money, um, flies around in a private jet, has 30-something cars, uh, uh, super successful. Anyway, that was just background. Everybody knows who Greta is, horrible human being, disgusting human being, uh, dedicated her life to, uh, to uh, trying to guilt us into uh, stopping to use fossil fuels and stopping to be civilized and stopping advanced civilization. So we got two pretty despicable human beings here that I deeply dislike, uh, Andrew Tate and Greta. Very different, very, very different uh, in, in every respect. Of course, Greta is now already 20 years old or 19, 20. Um, uh, so uh, she's grown up, uh, hasn't changed, still the same angry uh, Greta. Anyway, Andrew Tate dis decided to, to kind of... Uh, like, like uh, uh, play around with, with Greta a little bit and, uh, uh, and, and just his typical materialistic shallowness. He writes, uh, Andrew Tate writes, and again, this is why Dwight Wayne likes him so much because he trolls people like Greta. And, and if you troll Greta, you must be a good guy, right, by definition, because uh, if you hate the same people I hate, then you're obviously a good guy. Anyway, Andrew Troll wrote, um, hello, Greta Thunberg. I have 33 cars. My Bugatti has a... Uh, you know, 16, whatever, 8-liter quad turbo, my two Ferraris, 812, uh, Cantapizzone have 6.5-liter engines versus, and, uh, and 12 cylinders. This is just a start. Please provide your email address. I can send a complete list of my car collection and their respective enormous emissions. So this guy is just rubbing into ground of the fact that he emits a lot of carbon. So, but, but what's the point? What does this gain other than trolling Greta? So Greta, who is no idiot, comes back and says, yes, please do enlighten me. Email me at smalldickenergy at getalife.com, um, which everybody takes as, oh, man, she, she got one over him. And uh, this becomes a huge YouTube thing. And uh, the, this uh, conflict between Greta and Andrew Tate 
so they're, they're both insulting each other, uh, very adult, very argument-oriented, very intellectual, uh, very persuasive. Anyway, this, uh, and this is how Romanian police get involved. Um, Andrew Tate gets mad at this response by Greta, so he puts out a video um, uh, attacking Greta, uh, re replying to Greta, attacking her, uh, continuing the childish uh, back and forth. Now, it turns out that um, Andrew Tate is wanted by Romanian police, and uh, they did not know he was in Romania. Now, this is a story that I'm reading. I don't know if this is true or not, but this is the story. They didn't know he was in Romania. But when they saw the video, he sent Greta. In the video, he sent Greta, there are pizza boxes, pizza from Bucharest. That is the capital of Romania, where he lives, where he moved to so he could, so he could have looser uh, uh, rape laws. Anyway, the police noticed that he was now in Romania, and this is true. They raided, uh, they raided his home, arrested him and his brother, and two other Romanians, four people were arrested. Uh, they were arrested in Bucharest on suspicion of, quote, human trafficking, rape, and forming an organized crime group. Uh, this is what Romanian police, who have this lenient attitude towards rape, according to Andrew Tate, um, claimed in their statement. Uh, and um, uh, he was arrested and put in uh, jail yesterday. So um, <laughs> a bunch of idiots playing around. It's sad that nothing uh, negative happened to Greta as a consequence of this. It, it would be nice to have a, a complete justice and everybody getting their due. Um, when somebody moves as a UK passport, an American passport, but decides to live in Romania, somebody who probably is running some kind of uh, uh, porn ring and everything else, you know something is up primarily because of, of this reason. Uh, this is a bunch of uh, bad people having bad stuff happen to them, and um, you know, it. it, it uh, Andrew Tate will pay a lot of money to the lawyers. Uh, hard to tell. Romania probably has a pretty corrupt legal system, but now the world is watching, so we'll probably get a real trial. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. But I, I, I my suspicion is that uh, this, a uh, this suspicion of human trafficking rape. Is, is probably not outrageous and probably based on some real factual, uh, real facts and uh, that he's in real trouble. Anyway, let's hope that the hundreds of thousands of young men who follow him, maybe millions, I don't know, the hundreds of thousands of men who, who, who pay for Hustle TV to learn how to become rich, um, understand it maybe becoming rich and rotate style also has the potential to land you in jail. Thank you for listening or watching The Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show, we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to iranbrookshow.com support, by going to Patreon, subscribe star, locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one of those uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see the Iran Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content and of course subscribe. Press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are ready subscribers and those of you who are ready supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.